This is interesting. Just stay with us here for the Lions and Bears. Bears doing the shake. Not sure why. They've lost eight games in a row. Now, we're going to forget the first 57 minutes. Of this. <laughs> the Bears down 17-7. This is Jim Miller with a bad elbow in all third and 20. It's Des White for a 23-yard touchdown at 17-14. Bears down three. Next, on fourth and 20, did you see him fall down, get up, and complete a pass away for 33 yards? This actually is an amazing presence of mind. Yeah, Trip coming away from center, keeps his head up the field, spots Des White, nice 33-yard game. Your team sees you do that, they become a little bit more competitive. And then the human corkscrew, Paul Edinger, the kicker, ties it at 17, and we go to overtime. Now pay attention. Detroit wins the toss. They give the Bears the ball. Detroit takes the win. Bears, third and eight. Ain't complete to Dustin Lyman, but holding penalty on the Bears. And so on third and eight, Marty Morningway says, yeah, we'll take the penalty, give him third and 18, rather than have the punt. Miller to Marty Booker. Now that's 15 yards. Edger on the sidelines because remember it'd be a long field goal into the win would be about a 48 yarder. So fourth and three from the 31 and wouldn't you know it, Miller to White for five yards. First down Bears. Three running plays, 40 yard field goal. Edger, good. The Lions win the toss but never get the ball. Oh boy. Oh boy, I, I, I and Bears and Lions were so interesting this year that they went into overtime both times, Tom. <laughs> we couldn't get enough of them. This time the Bears went at the snap an eight-game losing Well, you, you just wonder what the situation had to be with the win in order for you to give that ball away. I would think that you'd be looking at a snowstorm or win 40 Rain miles an hour before you give that ball away. So the Bears win it, and the Lions still winless on the road in about 14 games.